what's up guys i got a nice unboxing review today a unboxing and review of the uh the nike db uh free runs before i start this video off like i said in my last video with the uh the free runs uh, i mean with the uh, free trainers uh let me guys know if you can see a difference in the camera quality because you know i upgraded from the 5 to the 5s right now and right now i'm running on the gold 5s so i just want to see if the camera looks any better than it used to look I just want to give you, you guys perspectives, <laughs> your guys uh, perspective. So please leave a comment down below to see if uh, it looks any better. Just to let me know. All right, guys, let's get right and then the Nike uh, DB free runs. I want to start off with I tried for the tents and I tried for the free run. I mean for the foams. For some reason, my internet connection was messing up, or I would have gotten. I mean, honestly, the internet connection really was messing up. I probably would have gotten them to be honest with you guys, because you know, I guys know I have a bot, but it's alright. I'm not. I'm not tripping or anything. I was probably just gonna resell them too, so it really wasn't a big deal. So, uh, yeah, anyways, I'm more excited for the December releases, too. But you got the red ones, you got the, uh, uh, the 11s, you got the 12s, so I'm excited for that. And I think the What the Kobe 8s come out, too, and you guys know that's going to be a crazy release for me. All right, so let's get right into the unboxing interview. The official colorway is Nike Free 5.0 Plus DB. And there it is right there. One thing I want to note, though, that's interesting, it says the 82 Retail... On here, but on the Nike receipt that they give you, it says 107, which is really weird. So I don't, I don't know what that is. So yeah. Um, for any of you guys that don't know about the Dorenbacher, it's a hospital for the sick kids, and they design the shoes. And then if the if the Nike likes the shirt and design that they make, the, and then they um then they release. Usually, Dortmunders are very limited, and they're only uh, Nike exclusives only. So that means they only release on Nike Towns and Nike Online. That's why they go for a lot of money. I'll read this off to you because this is a really good cause, and I know if you guys follow my Instagram, you know that I already tweeted about this. I mean, I already uh, made a photo about this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold this still for a little bit so you guys can read this for a couple seconds. <coughs> His name is Jake, that's who designed the shoe. And I'll show you a picture of him in a second. And here he is. Such a great such a great cause. I feel great having this shoe in my collection. And this shoe is really, really dope as well, so I'm definitely gonna be keeping this shoe. One thing I wanna know, which is so cool about the shoe, it's like how can I describe this? Uh, you know the Kobe cloaks? Like, I know how they change different colors in the Penny V cloaks. This is literally the same thing. I don't know if I can see you do it in this video, but it actually changes different colors. I didn't know that prior to buying the shoe, but it's such a cool feature. I know you guys that are familiar with the Kobe cloaks know what I'm talking about, especially if you the people that follow me on Instagram. But it's kind of like a colorway that pretty much just changes colors. It goes from a light green to a purple. It's really cool. Okay, over here, it says Free Jake. Free Jake up here again. With Nike. And then over here, it says, I wasn't made I wasn't made to fit in. I was made to stand out, which is really cool. And then inside, it says, never give up. And the bottom of the shoe, it is the Nike Plus One Night as well. And then over here... I'm not sure what this means, so if you guys know what this means, just let me know. It says, uh, hold on, let me zoom in real quick. BAS 1000. I don't know what that means, so. But if you guys know, then just let me know. And one thing that's cool about the shoelaces is it's different colors. It's purple down here, and then it goes up to a light blue over here. Which is really nice. And of course, we have a 5.0, and then on the side, it says Nike Free. Such a dope shoe. Feels great to have this in my collection and to be supporting the Boymakers. Seems like all the Dormaker free runs are pretty dope. I know they had the one that came out a couple years ago and it actually glowed in the dark and that was like so sick. I don't have that one though, just to clarify that. That's why I wouldn't do an unboxing review of that. But it is a really dope shoe. My friend has it. Alright, that's a quick little unboxing review of the Nike Free Run Dornbackers. 
Uh, this is the Jake edition. I just want to give a quick shout out to him and I hope for a speedy recovery. And um, just everyone that's sick and the kids, just so sad. And just it just feels great to have a great cause and just help these kids out. And all the proceeds go right to the hospital, so that's really nice. I feel like a lot of people don't really know the history of the Durnbackers, and it's kind of sad because it really is sick kids that make the shoes, and a lot of them don't live. Like the kid that made the, I think his name was Isaac, who made the uh, the Jordan 5s that just came out, he actually died, which is really sad. So, uh, yeah. But anyways, uh, please like and subscribe, guys. Make sure to check out my videos. Uh, follow me on Instagram. I repeat, Instagram is a place to hit me up if you have any questions, comments, concerns, want to buy shoes from me, etc. Shoe Game Messed Up, I repeat all one word, Shoe Game Messed Up. I'll leave a link in the description to that. You can follow me on Twitter too if you want. It's more of my personal account, but it's ZZSCH3NCKZZ. Please like and subscribe, guys. Make sure to check out my videos. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description to that. And make sure to comment if the video quality looks any better. Alright, thanks guys. Peace.